to sit down. Hey everybody! Um, <laughs> this is a funny video. Let me tell you what. I just did this video and um, <laughs> I uploaded it and for one, my hair is crazy and my appearance is crazy because when I did the video, you know, started this around like 8 something um, this morning and when I uploaded it, I guess I wasn't paying attention, <laughs> but I had like a sticker in my hair from my daughter this morning. And I was like, okay, gotta take it out, gotta do this all over again, because I was looking like a darn fool. So, and I guess when I did my video, I didn't realize how close I had the camera up. So, I think this is, you know, good. I think we're on the right path here to do what we have to do today. Um, this is just a Disney haul. There is one item that is not from the Dollar Tree, which is back here. Um, I just want to say that I'm doing a family trip. I have booked my tickets, the air flight, and a hotel this week and I'm so excited for me and my little family to go to Walt Disney World. It's going to be a magical whimsy. My daughter is um, going to have her birthday next month so she'll be four when we go on this trip. She's so smart and I think this is a fun age for kids to go out and um, you know go to Walt Disney World, see their like favorite characters. My daughter is a huge Minnie Mouse fan and huge Disney princess fan. She loves all the Disney princesses that her birthday next month, um, it's actually in like really two weeks now, is all Disney princess theme. But I got this hat at Walmart. It is embroidered in the back, Minnie Mouse. Um, this is about $7 at Walmart, and knowing how I am, if I see something that I like, it's really not going to be there, whether it's the Dollar Tree Walmart or really wherever. If you like it and you can get it, just go ahead and get it, because when you go back, you really wish that you had got that one item. And that's going to be really nice for her to wear. Um when we go to the park because we're going in June and it's going to be really hot. We're going the first weekend of June. So it's going to be so much fun. Alright, the next things are from the Dollar Tree. I have already washed and dried these. These are the wash rags that you wet and they unfold. So I'm packing everything flat and so I thought, you know, go ahead and wash these up, dry them, and put them in a Ziploc bag. And I told her we would take two of her Disney um, little washcloths. So that was Elsa and Olaf. And then this one is Ariel and Flounder. I really like this one. I think it's super cute. Which I will also, this is so random, but y'all know me. I like to ramble. Um, I will be vlogging a lot with my um, video camera while I'm at Disney so you all will get to see what we see when we go there and it's just gonna be so much fun and I cannot wait I'm just so 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 excited so I got this packed up already um I wanted to get her a mini LED nightlight to put in the bathroom so if she has to get up in the middle of the night, she can see. Um, I got two of these water bottle key rings. And these are perfect because the first thing I thought of wasn't really Disney or water bottles because it's going to be hot. One, they're flat. They're going to pack flat. So, and I'm, of course, I'm going to take it out of this packaging. But, um... Water is free in Disney. There's plenty of water fountains and restaurants that can give you water for free. I'll do this last. Um, I got this picture frame that I'm just going to keep here. It's the Arrive in Style. It's a 4x6 Disney Princess um, picture frame. 
and I'm going to put this on the side of the um, refrigerator with our family picture in it. So we're going to do that. Um, I got her this little um, princess light flashlight and at the end is a pen so it's a two in one. Which my Dollar Tree didn't have that many Disney things. I was really kind of sad because I know a lot more places carry a lot more things. I'm probably going to have to remove the sharpener out of this for airplane purposes. Because you know how strict they are. But it's just a um, Minnie Mouse stationery set. And it comes with a sharpener, a ruler, a pencil, and an eraser. And I thought that would be cute to put on her activity bag. Uh, to go in her activity bag, I just found these Finish the Sticker Scenes. It has three Disney princesses in new color and add the stickers to it. So I thought that would just be perfect to stick in there because it is an hour flight. These were my favorite finds because for the baby, which she will be for, but I call her my baby, the baby, because she's the baby at the house. She rules the roost. She is our pride and joy. I got her these fluffy key rings that they have out. They're like little pillow key rings. One in Cinderella and one in Minnie. One, uh, this one's going to go on her activity bag. And this one's going to go on her luggage uh, carry-on because that has Minnie and Daisy on it. And then Mommy and Daddy got... I got myself this one and I got Daddy this one. So... And I was so excited to see these. These are glow wands. Um, they've had these for several years. And I was like, oh my gosh, I just planned my trip. And I think they say January 2016 at the bottom of them. <laughs> so I really hope they work. If they don't, I'm going to freak out. But I really hope they do. Um... These are a dollar each. If you go to the park, they're going to be way more than a dollar there. So, um, this was a really fantastic find. And I was so happy to have found these items. Because I don't want to be paying like $12 to $20 for a glow wand at night time. When we are watching, um, when we're watching the little parade. I don't want, I don't want to pay that much. I'm trying to save myself. And with all the candy, cotton candy, ice creams, funnel cakes, lemonade, soda, whatever, juices, I got these and I thought they were so appropriate and needed because of the like classic mini. Um, <coughs> these are just wipes and these are perfect to put in a little bag while we're there. And the last item I got, I remember when I was a little girl, I went to Disney and it was actually cold. And this was like forever ago. Um, and like in the 90s or something like that. Um, and it was cold. And I didn't get to do much. And I didn't get to meet all the characters I wanted to. I didn't get to ride on a lot of rides. And I... It was magical but miserable at the same time because I didn't get that experience I always wanted to get. Um, but I remember asking my parents for a Disney autograph book. And that autograph book cost like probably 20 bucks back then. I'm not sure. But it was expensive. And so I found this at the Dollar Tree. I was looking for the Mickey and Friends one, but could not find the Mickey and Friends one. And I'm still on the look for the Mickey and Friends because I made this one for my daughter and I'd like to have one for myself. But I went ahead and, um, like, said that this was her book. I put each princess's stickers on the page so that, um, they could autograph it. So, I mean, it was just really... That's just how I did it. Something simple like that. And then put a big sticker at the end. And then I got to find some Mickey stickers to put in there for Mickey Mouse and all of them. But I thought for a dollar, this was perfect. 
because when you go to the park, you know for sure that you are not going to find an autograph book for a dollar there. You won't even find a pencil there for a dollar. It'll be like, here's four bucks for a straw for you to sip out of. Oh, thank you, because I'm going to need this straw. So, save money there. But if I can't find one, that's fine. Like I said, you know, this experience is for her and us as a family. Um, but I am excited to find, um, hopefully, a Mickey one so I can have one for myself. If not, this will work. Um, and I'm just so super excited to go on this trip. It's going to be our second family trip that we've ever been on. Last year we went to the Outer Banks. This year we'll probably still go to the Outer Banks, which is in July. Because that's like a huge, like, um, trip that a bunch of us and friends go on and family members. Like, like, we're just one big family. And it's fun because, you know, everyone's working so hard and we can't always catch up with each other when we need to. So this family trip to Disney is to really for me, my fiance, and um, you know our little one to have that family bonding moment, to soak in all the fun, you know, leave the stress here and everything else, you know, don't worry about work or anything, turn the phones off and. Let's just enjoy being a family, like that sort of deal. And plus, it's going to be magical there. Everyone knows that, you know, going to Orlando and going to Disney World is like this big magical experience. Well, that is what I can't wait to have for me and my little family. So, and it's much needed too. So, all right, guys. Well, excuse my crazy hair and appearance. Um... This is my second attempt to do this video, and I think this one went a little bit better than the other one. But anyways, hope you all enjoy. I hope you all have a blessed week. Um, now I have to get busy doing some stuff around the house. So, alright guys, well I will see you guys later. So, bye!